What's up, everyone? I'm back, finally, with a new episode. It's my hope that you are all doing well. Um, I've kind of been a little bit sick. I've had craziness at my job, but, uh... <clears throat> see, the voice, sickness, and whatever. Um, a little bit crazy at my job. I just haven't had time to film anything. I've still been getting things. Like the Amiibo. Um, so a lot of these actually came out a little while ago. I'm gonna put this one down for a second so I can get to some of these. So this is the, uh, the Mii Fighter 3-pack. This was at Toys R Us, Toys R Us exclusive. Um, and when... I'm, I'm gonna just go for it. I'm actually really excited to, to get these. I'm excited for all the Amiibo. They're all really cool for me. Um, but when I, when I got to Toys R Us, um, I actually wasn't, there wasn't a line or anything, and I was kind of concerned, um, but I walked in and I said, I need the Amiibo, and they are like, oh yeah, we have a thousand of them, and I actually went back to the rest just the other day, and they still had some, which leads me to believe that now they're not as rare, or people just don't care as much, um, but I like the Mii Fighters, and, uh, as much as, oh, I'm, so there's the Brawler. As much as, uh, I don't, I, I play with the Mii Brawler a lot. I don't like the Mii Gunner, and the Sword Fighter Mii just kind of reminds me of another Roy and Marth clone. There's the Gunner, which is pretty cool. Um, and the idea of Mii's is that you make them yourself, so having these faces and hairdo, like, preset, kind of seems counterproductive, counterintuitive to the whole point of the Mii's themselves. There's that one. But I got them. They're kind of cool. Brawler looks pretty cool. They all, they all look cool, but, uh, yeah. Anyway, so, um, both of these I had pre-ordered at Best Buy, uh, so we'll do Mewtwo first. Very excited for Mewtwo, and right off the bat, he's a lot bigger than, like, I thought he would be. Mewtwo's actually kind of big, and I was comparing him to, like, Charizard. Um, and Charizard, who's supposed to be giant, is actually not that big. I believe in, like, the official Pokédex, he's, like, five foot six or something like that, which means, like, I'm taller than, than Charizard. I mean, you imagine that he's a giant dragon, but he's, he's not that bad. Oh, Mewtwo is cool! <clears throat> the, uh, right at the bat, you can tell that the eyes are actually really detailed compared to some of the other models that we got, like, uh, uh, like Princess Peach or Zelda, their eyes were kind of weird. This one looks really sweet though. So there's Mewtwo, finally, and Mewtwo was the first DLC character. And, uh, he was actually released before Falco. Um, Falco here. He was released just the other day, actually, but before that, going back to... Toys R Us, we had the Mega Yarn Yoshi Amiibo, now this is for uh, Yoshi's Wooly World. Um, there were only a couple of these per store, and uh, I, when we picked it up there was only two or three left, and so we got one of the last ones, which is good. Um, and I haven't really cared, I don't have the, the Mario Party Amiibo, like a generic Mario Amiibo. Don't have the 8-bit Mario. I got Splatoon, that was mainly for abs. Um, I've mainly just been collecting the Smash Brothers Amiibo, because Smash Brothers! Uh, but this one was really cool, I didn't want to pass up. Oh my god, he's so cute! So we got a little sticker on his foot there. Probably just the uh, NFC ship. You take that off. That says Amiibo. And he can stand from other videos and stuff that I've seen, but he looks great! He's got a big ass nose, really cool. The tag says Yoshi. So, Amiibo aside, he's just a really cool plush. Um, really nice texture, really good quality. So that's, that's pretty deep. Um, so as for the box, there's nothing really special. You've got the, the pictures on either side. And then on the back it just shows like, oh, Amiibo support, whatever. So there's that. Nothing much. Um, 
Falco is one that I've been excited for forever. Anyone who is a professional Smasher knows that Falco is a superb fighter. Um, not to be messed with. Falco and Fox, not to be, not to be messed with. Uh, they were going to originally release Falco with Star Fox Zero, but when they pushed that back, they had this amiibo that hadn't been released yet. So he was released after Mewtwo because Star Fox Zero kind of sucked, kind of failed. Um, but it, it looks cool now. And Falco looks neat! Oh, sweet! He is really detailed. His feathers look all nice. His jacket looks nice. His little deflector thing looks nice. His gun looks nice. He's a good looking, oh my gosh. Look at him. Super detailed. Very cool. All right, so that's it. Um, again, I apologize for being out for so long, um, but uh, the craziness at my job is over, so I will be able to film more frequently. I have a couple more unboxings I'm doing. Just ordered a giant haul from Right Stuff uh, because they've got awesome holiday sales going on. Got uh, a couple unorthodox things that I haven't done before yet, uh, but I'm excited about doing. Gotta finish the library tours, gotta seriously gotta finish the library tours, but I need a new bookshelf. Um, the, the next one that I want to do is this big red case over here, but I have books behind books behind more books. So to do that one-handed filming myself and like pulling them apart would be madness. So I want to get regular shelves like the ones behind me. Um, so that hopefully within a week or two. Um, and then as always, uh, while I was looking for these, I was it was mainly me searching on um, Twitter, and I don't actually like Twitter uh, for for what it is. I think it's it's not something that I like to do. I don't really. I'm not. I used to try and post, but that really wasn't me. Um, and so I don't I don't post as often as I'm just like trolling through and, and, and looking for everything. Um, but you get a lot of cool news, and so I do have a feed. If if Twitter's something that you guys are interested in, you're probably more interested than I am. Um, go ahead, it's in the description below, so you can follow what I'm doing and what I'm reposting there. A lot of just regular anime news that if you're like aware of anime, uh, video game, manga culture, you're gonna be aware of anyway. But, uh, I mean, every now and then we get cool stuff. Like the Amiibo specifically, there was one that was like, Best Buy has got Falco up for pre-order, and I was like, oh, sweet Jesus, and reposted that, so. Different things like that. And as always, let me know what you guys think of the Amiibo, if you care. I know the Amiibo really aren't that important to a lot of you, but I still think they're awesome, so you're kind of stuck with them. Uh, but this is it. We've got Lucas that comes out on the 22nd of January. And then we haven't actually gotten confirmed releases for uh, Ryu, Roy, or Cloud, um, which I'm excited for if if they do get a release, I imagine they would, uh, but Nintendo has not said heads or tails whether any of them would as of yet. Yoshi is cute! Ah, oh, cool. Okay, well that's really it. Thanks for hanging out. I'll repost really soon again. Later, I promise. 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 Later, guys.